Hi guys, this is my first video blog for Close Combat Self Defence. My name is David Close and I am the founder of Close Combat Self Defence. And I just wanted to take today to run through the website. As you can see, I've got my contact information in the top left there, my phone numbers, my landline and mobile, uh, and then the menu at the top here. We've got the home page, which is basically just an introduction to the website itself. Got the Close Combat Self Defense logo there, the NFPS Limited logo there, who I train with. I'm an approved self defense trainer through them, and that actually links to their site where you can see that I'm on their list of, of approved self defense trainers. Then there's an introduction, uh, testimonials, which I haven't got yet, a bit more information about self defense, uh, Google Map, uh, which isn't yet set up, but it will show our exact location when I finally get round to sorting out where we're going to train which I will be doing in the next couple of weeks uh, then there's a little bit about me there my uh, history self-defense skills and training that's the home page the next link in the menu uh, leads to our Facebook page it opens up in a new tab uh, on our Facebook page you can like us there to get notifications you can message us directly uh, you can also click on the blue button which takes you back to the website to learn more about us. Um, there's a bit of information there on the title image. Uh, you can see about our events, about us. Everything that you can see on a normal Facebook page is there. But it's mainly for messaging us directly, finding out, out about news and events. Uh, back to the website. The next page on the website is the news and blog page. On this page you will see blog posts about self-defense techniques and demonstrations. As you can see that I've posted a few videos on there already. They automatically get sent to the Facebook page as well, which is great. So if you subscribe to us on Facebook you'll get those blog posts and any news I post instantly. I'll also be posting any club news, updates. Uh, when the club's opening, all that sort of information. I'll be making little video blogs like this to post on the website, which will go directly to Facebook, um, and uh, and I'll be using YouTube for that as well. The next page on the website is the grading page. I will be making individual videos for the grading page, the principles page, and the fact page. But just to give you a quick run through of each one, the grading page covers the different grades and how to go about getting your grades for each subject area within self-defense then there's a syllabus there which shows you everything you'll be learning but again I'll go through that in another video then there's the principles page the next link in the menu this talks about the fundamental principles again I'm going to go through this in a separate video the fundamental principles of self-defense in general they're taken from uh, traditional martial arts very good principles to stick by then underneath that we've got the lesson principles which are more about things you need to think about and do whilst training at the club each one of those principles is used in every single aspect of self-defense knowing those will help you to learn self-defense at the club the next page is the fact the frequently asked questions. On this page I answer the simple questions that we get regularly, the questions that generally just get asked to self-defense clubs as well. I've chucked that in there. It's information about the classes, what to wear, etc. But I will go through that again with you in a separate video. The last page on the website is a contact us page. It's a simple email form. You put your name and address and any questions you've got there that aren't answered in the fact and then click submit and that goes straight to my email account. I will pick that up and answer within 24 hours. Normally I'll answer it within a couple of hours but I put 24 hours on there just to give me some time. Failing that you can also contact me on the Facebook page like I said or contact me on my phone number which is there at the top of the page again. And that's the website so check it out. If you've got any questions or you notice anything that could be added to it, just let me know and I will get back to you.